Hey guys, it's me, Jake, from JakeMan21642. Today I've got a video for you of this 2007 Volvo XC90. This one is a very nice V8 all-wheel drive model. As you can see, it's finished off in a silver metallic exterior, which is a great clean looking color on the XC90. Outside, you can see this one does have your satin silver trim around the windows, tinted rear privacy glass, and your pinstripes running down the side. Body colored door handles, as well as your side molding down below, and this one also does have body colored mirrors, turn signal indicators built into those. Up top, you can see the sunroof, as well as your roof rails. And back here, this one does have your XC90 and V8 all-wheel drive badges, of course. Dual exhaust tips down below. And you do have a Reese trailer hitch on this one. I mean, this is an insanely clean XC90. On this side, you can see you do have your fuel cap. And down here, this one is riding on Bridgestone tires, which are in good shape. They are 23560R18s, so 18-inch alloy wheels, rear disc brakes on this one. And up front, you can see this one does have halogen headlamps, your headlight washers, as well as uh, fog lights down below. Get in and start it up. It does include your typical Volvo key with lock, unlock, trunk release, panic, and then this button, which will turn your uh, parking lights, as well as the puddle lamps underneath of your mirrors on. And inside, this one does have the off-black leather interior which is in great shape. You can see this one has my favorite option on the XC90, the wood grain steering wheel. Do have a full power driver's seat with three person memory, as well as your all weather floor mats down below. And to start, just insert the key and flick to start. I just love the sound that these old Volvo V8s make. It's such a unique engine note. Go ahead and close the door. Inside you can see this one does have your cruise control as well as your audio system controls on the wheel. Nice and tight hydraulic power steering as well. On the door up top, it's all padded material, padded leather around here and a padded armrest. All for your automatic windows, power locks, power mirrors. Headlight controls over here as well as your front and rear fog lights, parking brake release, fuel cap release, and your gauge dimmer. Dashboard all the way across is soft, high quality material. You have your uh, center channel for the audio system right there. And you can see the gauges. You have your engine temperature, as well as your speedometer right there, tachometer, and then your fuel gauge on that side. Down here too, this one does have a multi-function display. You can scroll through from right here, bring up all kinds of different options and things like that. And this one does have 159,000 miles, but you can never be able to tell. Um, in the middle, two air vents, your hazard controls. Down here is your audio system, nice and simple to use. Some storage, as well as your CD player, everything on this side. Um, like I said, it's simple to use. Have your preset stations and everything else, and it sounds great. Um, dual zone automatic climate control down below, heated seats for the driver and passenger. Once again, all of this is very simple to use, your zones and everything else. Fan speed, rear AC on and off, as well as um, an outlet over here. Storage, wood grain around here in your leather stitch shift boot, wood grain shift knob. And this one does have the six speed automatic manual mode, reverse, and you do have your winter mode right there. Cup holders underneath of this cover, as well as your auxiliary in. Like I said, two cup holders, more storage, and a padded armrest right here. Storage inside of there with your CD slots, as well as this can go all the way back and act as a tray for rear passengers. The seats in this vehicle are very comfortable, high quality leather, and the leather is in great shape too for one of these. You can tell this one was very well taken care of. Up top, sunroof, as well as interior lighting controls, your sunroof controls, all of that right there. Auto dimming rear view mirror, garage home link, and your visor will flip down, does have a vanity mirror built in. Step out of this one, everything is unlocked. Inside the rear seat of the Sexy 90, everything follows through, it really is in fantastic shape. You can access the third row from right here, just pull that forward. And to fold the third row down, release that, push the seat all the way back, and then that comes down just like that. 
You also have uh, storage comp or excuse me, cup holders and storage compartments for rear passengers and rear fan controls. Inside of the rear seat, it's very comfortable. I'm 6'2", I can fit back here perfectly fine. Do also have your rear air vents built in, as well as a power outlet, storage, and two cup holders. Back seat pockets on each side, as well as a child booster seat in the middle, built in from the factory. It does latch down, just like that. Interior lighting up top. And overall, the interior of this vehicle really is just a great place to be. Inside of the trunk on this one, plenty of space. You can see this one does have both of your um, all-weather mats for the rear. And I did leave half of the, uh, the third row up to give you an example of your trunk space with the third row up versus with the third row down. As you can see, you do have your tailgate too. Power outlet for the trunk, as well as on this side, the storage, cup holders, all of that follows through. And you do have air vents built into the pillars for the rear passengers. I mean, like I said, this is just a very clean V8 all-wheel drive. As these age, these are really getting harder to find in this shape with relatively decent miles on them. Same operation for the third row. Fold it down, push in, bring that down. We'll bring that back. Up front, you do have a power passenger seat in this one. Everything follows through on this side, as well as inside of here. This one does include your state inspection certificate, as well as your lighting, all of that. You can see what I mean, too, about just how clean this one is inside. And up front, your halogen headlights, fog lights, and under the hood on this XC90. This one does have the 4.4 liter V8. This is a Yamaha tuned V8 as well. Everything under here is clean, running fantastic. Does that. Bring the automatic driver's side window back up and cut it off right here. Move the key. And as always, this vehicle is for sale at Volvo of Richmond here in Richmond, Virginia. If you are interested in this XC90, please let Volvo of Richmond know you saw this video. Thanks for watching.